Okay, now that we have created a copy of the vocabulary um, and we are inside of it, we are gonna make a few changes in the settings. So um, if you see right now, if I say something, let's say, I, I went, went away. away. So you see just the words show up here. Um, it is very helpful to have the symbol show here. So we're gonna to go to menu and settings. And then we're gonna scroll down to show icons. And so now we have a larger bar up here um, and it shows this symbol. So that is really helpful. Um, I would recommend that for sure. The next thing we need to do is the voice. And so right now the default is Heather. So um, there are some child voices that come standard with it. So. I am Penny, one of the available high quality text to speech voices. Select download now to install my voice. So if you find a voice that you like, um, you can go through different ones here. Um, you may have to download it. So let's download Kenny. Okay, and now we can choose him. Um, you can also change things like the rate, how fast he speaks, um, the pitch, if you want him to have a higher voice or a lower voice. Um, so, you know, there's lots of things you can go through in selecting the voice to determine what will be best for you. The next thing we're going to go to is button margin. There's a lot of different things that you can, um, edit here, but if you think it may help your kid, um, not everyone does this. You can change the size um, in between, at a margin in between each button. So, you know, if you think having a bit of an outline will help, um, be easier to touch things, you know, to touch the right button, you can make a pretty big one. Um, some people recommend eight. For us, it doesn't really make a difference, so I'm gonna say none. Um, and so those are just a few different things that you can change. Um, one other thing that I would recommend changing, right now you see the skin tone for all of the symbols is different, so it's set to random. So we're gonna go to menu, um, vocabulary settings, and this is the symbol six. These are the, the type of symbols that are here. It's set to random, and so depending on you know your child's skin tone, it will set them all to the same color. And I think that's helpful just to, um, you know, have your child feel like it represents them. So we'll do this one. Um, and those are just a few things for initial customizations.